Welcome to the amazing world of the art of Jean-Pierre Straub. In a technique known as marquetry, Jean-Pierre uses wood inlay veneers to create incredible two-dimensional artworks. Jean-Pierre learned his art from his father, a master cabinet maker, and he's been producing marquetry for almost 40 years. Remarkably, he still has the first piece of art he created as a boy in 1963, and he's delighted to show his original artwork to anyone who has a chance to visit him. Creating fine art with paper-thin wood veneer can be traced back to the master cabinet makers of the 16th century in Florence and Naples. Other than the introduction of electricity, the tools remain the same. A tiny saw, sharp knives and chisels, glue, and an extremely steady hand. The heart of marquetry is in the wood veneer. Jean-Pierre uses over 60 types of wood from around the world, including Africa, Arabia, South America, and Europe. Jean-Pierre starts with a photograph of the subject he wants to create, and turns the photograph into a segmented drawing on paper. From there, he begins the painstaking technique of laying down the veneer, over 400 pieces in the larger works. To stick the veneer to the paper, Jean-Pierre uses traditional fish glue that he warms in a little pot. The glue is okay when it's fresh, but after a few days, it can become rather smelly. But I like it, Jean-Pierre said. Fortunately, the smell of the glue does not accompany the finished work as the marquetry is removed from the paper and fixed to a sturdy wood backing for framing. Depending on the size, it can take Jean-Pierre over 100 hours to finish a piece of art. That, and 40 years of experience. Whilst demonstrating his techniques, Jean-Pierre shared a couple of secrets, like the way he adds shade to his work by dipping the veneers in hot sand. Jean-Pierre has traveled extensively in the Caribbean, and the local island scenes form the backbone of his work. What is Jean-Pierre's favorite subject? Always the last one I finish, he says, which pays tribute to the way he continues to experiment and redefine his craft. His friends and fellow artists say his work is more beautiful year to year, and I believe it. It's fair to say that Jean-Pierre's marquetry could stand alongside the best in the world. In addition to the artworks that you see featured not only in this video, but in the Dreams Boutique in the Mahu Lobby. Jean-Pierre is a creative artist that has the ability to work on commissions as well as unique custom pieces. So speak to your art director for more information. The art of Jean-Pierre Straub found in the Dreams Boutique is almost too much to take in all at one time. The details are exquisite and include everything from everyday Caribbean scenes to vivid creation from the artist's imagination. Although the local scenes are the best sellers among hotel guests because they represent not only stunning unique artworks, but also a souvenir from the